to whom Sukhdev Goswami is doing pranam, huh? who knows everything. He is like Krishna, Sadhbhapi. Hmm? And what is Srimad Bhagavatam? This is a bridge-like or boat. Bridge is connecting two things. Hmm? After ocean, Ramchandra a, made a bridge from India to Lanka. So, Ocean, great is ocean is this sun, power, sansar, coming in this world, endless pain, a birth, endless birth and death. Bridge is Srimad Bhagavatam. Or boat, if you go to bridge, you will see only by touching that we are out of this Maya. Or if you go to boat, and touch the boat, boat will be here, but you will see that we have a cross. So Srimad Bhagavat is so wonderful. So, <clears throat> Vasudev Bhagavati Bhakti Yoga Prayosita Janyate Asu Bairagyam Gyanam Charjata Hai Dukam If anyone <coughs> will follow Bhakti Yoga <coughs> to Krishna, Vasudeva, then surely by he hearing Srimad Bhagavatam, practice Bhakti Yoga, all kinds of knowledge, Krishna Tattva, Jiva Tattva, Maya Tattva, Prem Tattva, Bhakti Tattva, Rasa Tattva, Ra Krishna Tattva, Radha Tattva, everything. And also detachment from worldly this Bhairagya. Surely it will come. If you are hearing Bhagavat, Chaitanya, uh, chanting name, but no Bhairagya is coming. No detachment from worldly things. No Tattva again. Then what is this? There is some loopholes. So try to repair. Otherwise, <coughs> Dharma Sunishchita, Punsa, Vishwaksain Katha Suja, Not Padya Yadirateen If you are chanting, if you are remembering, if you are doing so many things, but no taste in Hari Katha, then what? After some time, you will give up. So there must be first Taste in hearing Hari Katha. I am happy that for hearing Hari Katha you have assembled here. But take all these Hari Katha in your heart forever. Hmm? Then Srinvata Angswa Katha you. And after that Om Ajnana Timiranda Siya Jnana Anjana Shalakaya Chakshurun Militam Yena Tasmai Shri Gurave Namaha <coughs> So Srila Gurudev has been narrating the introduction to the Srimad Bhagavatam telling us about Srila Vyasadeva's dissatisfaction and Sri Narada Muni, his spiritual master, coming to teach him what was his mistake in not glorifying directly the Supreme Lord. And now he is narrating the beginning of the uh, narration of the Srimad Bhagavatam by Sutta Goswami. Yes, sir. By Sutta Goswami. And how the sages of Naimasharanya, headed by Shonakarishi, began to inquire from Sutta Goswami. 
And they wanted to know, Yenatma Suprasiddhati. How the Atma, how the soul, may become completely satisfied, completely fulfilled. And then in his uh, answer to their various questions of the sages, Srila Sutta Goswami, he began to explain about the importance of hearing the powerful message of the Srimad Bhagavatam. And how if a person performs all of his duties in life perfectly, but the performance of those duties does not result in attraction to hearing the message of Srimad Bhagavatam, the message of Krishna Kata, then all of his activities in life are actually a shrama, that means useless labor or a waste of time. So now, Sutta Goswami began to explain that if a person hears this powerful message of Srimad Bhagavatam, then what will be the effect in that person by this powerful hearing? Srila Gurudev told us in his first words this evening, the message of Srimad Bhagavatam is very, very powerful. So here, in these shlokas, now Srila Sutta Goswami is describing how the power of Srimad Bhagavatam will act in the heart of the listener. First of all, he says, Shrin Vatam Svakata Krishna, Punya Sravana Kirtana, Hridhyantak Sto Hyabhadrani, Vidunoti Suhrit Satam. Here is describing that this Krishna Kata is a Punya Shravana Kirtana. It is the most powerful and glorious activity of hearing and chanting that can be performed in this world. Uh, and within the heart of the listener there may be so many abhadras that means inauspicious things which are preventing him from attaining his eternal relationship with Krishna and preventing him from developing Krishna Prem these anartas, these unwanted things are hampering the progress of the soul but the power of the Srimad Bhagavatam, this Krishna, Krishna Kata enters within the ears. And then, Sri Krishna himself, as Srila Gurudev told, he begins brooming. Brooming means that now he begins to clean the heart himself. Vidhunoti Suhritsatam. In the heart of the devotee, he becomes the well-wishing friend of the devotee, seeing that he is trying to hear about me. So now Krishna himself acts within the heart and he begins to cleanse the heart. Then nashta prayeshu abhadreshu nityam bhagavata sevaya bhagavati uttama shloke bhaktir bhavati naishtiki. Then next, by constantly performing bhagavat seva, hearing this message of Srimad Bhagavatam nityam regularly, constantly, from the lips of the Bhakta Bhagavat. Two types of Bhagavats. Srimad Bhagavatam, the book, the Granta, and the pure devotee, who is the very embodiment of the message of the Srimad Bhagavatam, the Bhakta Bhagavat. Nityam Bhagavata Sevaya, by constantly uh, serving the pure devotee and constantly hearing the message of Srimad Bhagavatam from him. Then, when these anartas within the heart, these abhadras, nashtat praishu abhadreshu, when they're uh, very much removed, not completely, but a very uh, good amount of these abhadras have now been eliminated. Nityam bhagavata sevaya bhagavati uttama shloke bhaktir bhavati naishtiki. Then that person will now attain to the stage of naishtiki bhakti. That means firm uh, faith in the process of performing bhakti jog. Now he will continue constantly, never deviating from the path of bhakti. Eh? And he will go forward very, very quickly in this stage of nishta. So now, tada rajastamo bhava kama lobha dayaschaye cheta etair anavidham stitam sattve proceed. <coughs> So now, rajas and tamas, the modes of passion and the modes of ignorance, which cause 
the effect in the heart of kama, lobha, that means lust, greed, envy, illusion, anger. These kinds of effects in the heart are coming from the force of the modes of nature, rajagun and tamagun, passion and ignorance. So when these become completely removed and cheta etair anavidham, now the consciousness, the pure soul becomes unaffected by these lower modes. And stitam sattve prasidati, now he becomes situated in sattvagun, where uh, he becomes prasidati, satisfied, no longer hankering for the material objects of this world, no longer lamenting uh, for anything lost in this mundane plane. So now, he becomes evam prasanna manaso, bhagavad bhakti yogataha, bhagavad tattva vijnanam mukta sangasya jayate, evam prasanna manaso. Now his mind, now his internal consciousness becomes completely uh, satisfied, prasanna. Uh, he becomes very uh, uplifted in, in the deepest part of his soul, his consciousness. Uh, and he becomes firmly situated in Bhagavad Bhakti Yogataha. And all tattva, all transcendental knowledge, Bhagavad Tattva Vigyanam, now he gains realization of all the transcendental truths of the Supreme Lord. Uh, Bhagavad Tattva, Jiva Tattva, Maya Tattva, Krishna Tattva, hmm? all of these different transcendental spiritual truths and realities become manifested within his heart. And Mukta Sangha Syajayate. Now he becomes actually free. He becomes liberated from the effect of the material nature, even though he's living within this world. But now he becomes transcendental to the effect of na material modes of nature. And then finally, Bidyate Hridaya Grantish Chidyante Sarva Samshaya Kshiyante Chasya Karmani Drishta Evatmanishvane. So now, Bidyate Hridaya Grantish. Now the knot that is in our heart, like a tightly woven knot caused by all past karmas uh, and all material desires within this world, Bidyate Hridaya Grantish, it becomes pierced. And Chidyante Sarva Shamshaya, all of the doubts that prevent us from completely surrendering to the Supreme Lord, they can be completely destroyed. Uh, uh, chiyante chasya karmani and the constant uh, chain the repetition of karmas in this world which cause us to take repeated births and deaths and continue suffering this chain becomes terminated drishta evat manishwari now the soul sees that actually the supreme lord the supreme atma he is my ishwara he is my controller. Everything is controlled by Him. I belong to Him. He belongs to me. This realization comes in the heart of the soul who hears this message of Srimad Bhagavatam. So, so powerful is this message. And if someone receives this message in their ear holes with faith from the pure devotee, from the lips of the pure devotee of Krishna, then it is definitely certain that if they follow those instructions, these effects will come one after the other, and the soul will attain his eternal relationship with Krishna. So, this Samadhi Grantha, done, done by, manifested by Srila Bhyas Dev, Jasyavaj Suyamanayan Krishna Paramapurushe Bhakti Rupa Paddhyatahe Punsa Sok Mo Bhayapa. If even anyone here with strong faith and great honor, then Krishna will be pleased. Bhakti will come Soka Moha Bhayapa. There will no so, lamentation, 
erosion or anything. You will go across death forever. Hmm? So kindly he has manifested Srimad Bhagavatam. In this up to ninth canto, we see Bharat Charitra, Bharat Maharaj. How he left as a stool, Krihastasram, wife, sister, mother, kingdom, everything, wealth, reputation. But he was entangled with a deer. And how he lost his three, he was up to bhav, rati. So, he again, after three births, he again began to do bhakti. But for we, if you will go down, oh, very, you can come, never come out of that. After that, Ajamil Upakhyan, Chitraketu Maharaj Upakhyan, Prahlad Upakhyan, Nishinghadev, Hirinyakashpu, and all these things. How Prahlad was tolerated. You should try to be tolerated like Bharat, um, Prahlad Maharaj. You should read again and again Prahlad Charitra. You will be strong. And after Chitraketu Maharaj Upakhyan, after Ram, Ram Lila, past time, sweet past times of <coughs> Ram Lila. And after that he came in 10th Kanto. In 10th Kanto, three kinds of past times. Balla Lila, Pauganda Lila, Kumar, and then Kaisor, and then Yongish. In Balle Lila, Putana, Trinavart, Shakshtasur, Uddhar, Liberation. Very interesting Harikathas. After Dham Bandhan, being Supreme Lord, very powerful, having six appliances, no outer, no inner. No up, no down. And just the mother with love and affection, he bound it and began to chastise. chastise. And that Supreme Lord was weeping, weeping, weeping. Very wonderful. And then he came to <coughs> Vrindavan, Dhenukasu. Bhatsasur, Aghasur, Bakasur, Shankachud, Keshi, Bemasur, and so many demons. He, why? Jada Jadahi Dharmasya, Glanir Bhavati Bharata, Abhyutthanama Dharmasya Tadatmanam Sijamya. To establish Dharma. And to demons, to liberate demons, <laughs> not uh, so <coughs> he did. So they were the burden of earth, he removed. And when he came to <coughs> Mathura, O Kans, Charun, Mosti, all others, and he defeated Jarasandha eighteen times with so many Akhoni, more than Mahabharat. Eighteen times, great weight of Prithvi was taken, and then Oh, Kaljaman, you know, Kaljaman, by the hands of Krishna's Supreme Lord, very powerful, 
but he could not kill Jarasandha by Bhim. He killed him. He was great demon. And then Mahabharat. Huh? Ah, by Mukunda. And then then in Mahabharat Yuddha, Atharha Akshavani, 18. So many. And thus remembered so much weight of Prithvi. And then Rukmi, Shishupal, Dantabakra, Hirnakaspu and Jay Vijay. Then Portrick Vasudev, he made artificial two hands and took chakra and all other things and he told, Oh Krishna, don't cheat others, I am Vasudev, Krishna. Otherwise, you should be ready to fight. Oh, Krishna began to laugh. Oh, yes, you are really. And then he came and he killed Pandit Basta and Kashi Naresh, the king of Kashi, who was also like demon. And so he's all. And after that, Krishna was thinking. Still, or Jadubans is there, the dynasty of Jadu. Very powerful. Hmm? So if I will ascend to Golok Vrindavan, I will go, then they may create so many things. So they are also great burden of earth. <coughs> so how should I remove? And then he inspired in the yogis and rishis muni heart in Durbasa and other. Samba was very beautiful. So all the Raj princess, prince of Jadu dynasty, young, they decorated Sam as a wife, a very beautiful lady, and they put some cloths and other things here and made it very that she is pregnant. And they went to Narad, Durbasa, and others and asked, Oh, she is very shy. She cannot ask. She wants to know whether son or daughter will come from his home. One time, two times, three times, then Durbasa became, oh, not son and no daughter, but a musal will come. Club will come. And by that whole dynasty will be, Jadu dynasty will be finished. Oh. By fear they don't, did not told to Krishna. They tell to Ugrishen. And then, anyhow, Krishna knew. And he saw that now so much Yashi uh, Apsagun. Uh, blood raining. So much storms, winds coming. Elephants weeping, dogs weeping, so many things. Then Krishna told, Oh, we are seeing so much, so many distresses. Oh, <coughs> I also left something. After Rash Lila, <coughs> After Rash Lila, he went to Dwarka, married with Rukmini, Satnama. Eight 
Patarani, prominent queens, and 16,000 other Rukmini and other ladies. He liberated so many kings from the jail of Jarasandha and also Narkasur. Narkasur wanted to marry with them, but Krishna killed them. And then Rukmini, Sattabhama and other he did all marriage and made them queen in Dwarka. And then he was thinking now with the prayer of Brahma and Shankar that for what you have come it is everything is done. We want that you should go to Kulok Bandaban and in the way you should come in our Brahmalok. And then Krishna accepted. That is why he inspired in the heart of Durbasa to give that thing. And then Krishna went to Prabhastitha and began to denote so many things to Brahmins, to please Brahmins. And he began to do fire sacrifices. And in fire sacrifice, they took Marin a kind of whiskey, wine, wine. And they became all mad. And they all began to fight together. When their Astra Shastra were finished, weapons, then they took the Sarkanda, like bamboos. <coughs> very sharp and it, it became like thunderbolt and they fought together each other and they all finished. How it became? Krishna wanted to go to Golok Vrindavan so by his Jilujri Maya those who have come from Kulok Bandaban, those who came from heaven, by this it was illusory, like dream. And all were, all went to their abode. Some went to Swargalok, some went to Baikuntha, Jai Bijay, and like that. And many others went to Golok Bindavan, especially the kings also. It has shown that they also burnt with their husbands, but really not. <clears throat> Vishwana Chakvarti Thakur has told that there was a magician no? and he went to a king and began to show his his wife climbed on the rope, having taken so many features full of water, and one knee a bamboo on her hand, and she was dancing above rope. King and queen very became very happy, and he, they gave a necklace to that lady. Then two sons, hmm, young age, they began to fight. Mother, I will take, I will take. They began to fight. Mother left. And then equal, strong, hmm, they fight together and they took their sword and at once he caught his neck and he caught. Both died. Oh, father, told, oh, my son, my these sons are dead. Oh, he took the and, and wife also at once came and oh, it became very sorrowful. <laughs> then queen and queen.
been very up unhappy. Anyhow, they did sanskar and went to their palace. In the morning, a letter came to them. Maharaj, you gave first puraskar for dancing on the rope. And what we did, we are not dead, dead. Still we are waiting for your reward. Oh, if you have no faith, you can come and see. Oh, we are alive. Then king and queen became very happy and they went there with their associates and they saw that, oh, with garland, of four are ready to. So Krishna did all these miracles because he is magician of ma magician. So in this way he took his all associating heavenly planet and also by Kunta Vrindavan. Then I will tell another thing tomorrow. Now one kirtan, Krishna. When uh, Krishna's uh, relatives killed each other, but why would Krishna think um, that, because you said he was thinking before, that when I leave, they will create some chaos? Yes. In Jadvansi, uh, like Pradyumna Aniruddha, all were manifestation of Krishna. They are parikar of Krishna. But other some are very nonsense. They would do something. So for them, he did so. Yes. Huh. Jai Jai Radha Ramana Hari Bom Jai Jai Radha Ramana Hari Bom Jai Jai Radha
Son came from Mexico. Oh. His Mexico. son, son from Mexico. 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 No, no, he's at home with his 
Hare Krishna. सरनाकरों 
राधा कृष्ण पदार बिंद भजनानंदीन मतवालिको बंदे रूप सनातनो रघुजुग श्रीजीव गोपाल को कृष्ण कीर्तन गान नतन पर प्रेमृतनी श्री चैतन्य कृपाभन भुवि भुव भरा बहंतारक बंदे रूप सनातन रघुजुग श्रीजीव गोपाल को पापत्रापनिकन भिता गोविंद गानृत श्री गौरांग गुणानुबन्न विधो सद्या सनिधानित पापत्यापनिकन तन भिता गोविंद गानृत आनंदाबुदिवर्धन कनिपुना